think we, we started off well. Um, uh, lucky to lose to Australia. We won against Hong Kong, but uh, we kind of like fell off our middle stool and uh, just uh, lost concentration and we've lost the last two games. So it's a big game for us tomorrow. Playing PNG, we need to uh, try and get as many points as possible just so we, because uh, I think we're on the same points as uh, Hong Kong. I think uh, the reason why we're here is that uh, we start off with Oceana. We had, uh, we've only had about four weeks preparation, but now that we see the, the competition that it is now, it's of, of high standard. So we need to go back after this tournament and report back to our union, and we have to uh, sit down and plan out a, a longer strategy uh, for next year because we want to do well in Oceana. I think we have the players. We just haven't really focus on the sevens as much as we had in, uh, probably 10 years ago. So, um, you know, I, I think Samoa's got a big future in the sevens, women's sevens, and it's uh, our job to, um, you know, start building up for next year. Um, I think we're, we've got about uh, 300 women playing rugby, and, you know, we have it right across probably about a, maybe about a thousand across the whole of Samoa. Uh, but the competition is only like six teams, ten teams, and we tend to play each other over a three month period. So, um, but then we have players in New Zealand, Australia, and that's the, the people we haven't targeted at the moment. We're trying to use our um, grassroots uh, players, but uh, with the level that uh, the sevens are at the moment, as you can see with China and um, Japan, you know, they're very fast and very hard to catch, so uh, we have to go back and start again and focus on our sevens for women. Rugby.